Hey, what's up, guys? Um, it's just me right now. The review and watch along were both of us, but this is just me because um, I've tried to edit this watch along uh, countless amounts of times now, and it keeps getting blocked. And I, I've cut it up way too much, I feel. Um, and I don't know why it's this way. It's just what it is. But, um, so I'm just having to release the review on YouTube just so you guys can know our thoughts on, um, the second part of Moonabai. Um, but, yeah, unfortunately I won't be able to post the watch along because I just, every time I've cut it up, it, it's still getting blocked and I'm tired of editing it. I apologize. Um, so if you'd like to see the full uncut, uh, watch along, you can head over to Patreon or channel memberships. Uh, we'll also have that. Um, and I'll put the link in the description below and in the pinned comment so you can go check out the watch along and I'm very sorry once again um, I wish I could have given it to you guys but uh, enjoy the review that was uh, that was that was really sweet it, it didn't it had the same heart as the first one just not as much at least comedy mm -hmm. that we could get uh, and I, so like that part, I think was the, probably the biggest disconnect between the two in terms of the, the comedy really helped enforce a lot of the, yeah. the, the really getting into it. Yeah. And since I, I, we, there was some, obviously I laughed out loud multiple times. It's just, it, it's hard to not compare the two obviously, cause we just basically almost saw them back to back. Right. Um, but I, I enjoyed it. Uh, it's just, I, I don't think I, I definitely didn't enjoy it as much as I enjoyed the first one for sure. Agree. Even yeah. though it had the same, I, I feel like it did have the same heart. It had, just, it had a similar heart yeah. and it had, it had some fun points. Yeah. There were places in it that dragged where the other film didn't. Yeah. And you can tell the why as to why the two movies were made. The first one was made with a, a deeper artistic why than this one. This one was made because the first one was a success and they said, hey, let's make a sequel. Mm. Okay, what are we going to say? I don't know. Let's, let's, let's come up with something that's going to work. With We'll use these same characters and uh, it, it was still, it's still fun. Yeah. But yeah, I I personally, yeah, I would watch the first one again in a heartbeat. Yeah. I wouldn't necessarily watch this yeah. one. If it was on, I might leave it on and enjoy some of the, the funny parts in it, but I, I much prefer the first one. Yeah, and I think a lot of the comedy that maybe we miss is... Because it was told in the first one, and we love the first one, obviously, um, but I was told that a lot of the comedy, even in the first one, so yeah. I assume in this one as well, is from how they are speaking. Like accent, dialect. Accent, dialect, mm. also what they're saying, like the slang they're using is a ton of the comedy in both movies. So in other words, it would be comparable to us watching a film and hearing somebody say beauty and knowing their Canadian English yeah. versus somebody saying, get out of here, and we yeah. would know their East Coast English. So, and I heard a bunch of people after the after we watched the first one, they said, yeah, the second one's even better. So I'm guessing there's a lot- It's gotta be a lot more of that. In here. Yeah. Uh, also, it has the, 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 the like I said, I, this does have the same Rajkumar Hurani heart to it, obviously, right? In yes. terms of like, it's it's still silly, but it's like okay, there's a his, his underlying sense of good. He's trying. Obviously, this one has Gandhi as well, so there's mm. some patriotism aspects. Yeah, to there, this that's one. that's a, that's very sweet. Um, and so that 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 does keep you engaged. It's just the um, I think the the biggest disconnect was the fact that I I wasn't laughing as much, right? And so I wasn't like as engaged or invested in their story exactly as I was in the first one, right? That I, even though it's all still silly and goofy, it's just I was a lot more engaged in the first one, right? Um, it, and maybe it's similar to because it, it, it was a lot. I mean, I mean, there was different films sure, for sure, but a lot of the same plot points of the first film, right? Yeah. Um, Kind of similar to Back to the Future. Back to the Future is three films. Back to the Future 1, 2, and 3 are the exact same film. They're just yeah. ones in the past and ones in the future. Right. <laughs> uh, if you've not seen... Or one's in the... The third one's in the West, right? Yeah. And the second one is in the past? I forget. But they're essentially... If you haven't seen it in a while, I don't know if you have... I, have, I haven't seen two and three in a almost long time. Almost the exact time. plot points right. just in the West. I, I haven't seen the two and the three. And so it's not that time. egregious uh, for this one. Um, and I didn't do it. I love Circuit. Oh, I yeah. could do an entire film 
just about the circuit character, just because I think he's such an endearing, sweet uh, character. And I think the actor that plays him does uh, a very good job. Yeah, I do too. Um, uh, the, 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 that's it right there. Yeah. Uh, Arshad Warsi. Arshad Warsi. Did it also seem to you that it wasn't Vidya's voice? It may not have Obviously been. Obviously, it was dubbed. It was dubbed. But it didn't, like in Om Shanti Om, right. you would saw, that's not Dipika's voice. Right. I don't know if you knew that. Um, and I'm wondering, since this was early on in her career, if they did the same thing. Maybe so. Or maybe it was her voice. It just didn't feel like did, her yeah. voice. I agree. It, it felt very um, different uh, to me. But um, I like the, there was some songs in this one. That was, it, it is interesting, even though there's some nice songs compared to, in this Maybe this was more to maybe we were expecting more comedy because obviously the first one had a bunch of comedy. This probably had the same amount of comedy that Three Idiots and PK had. Because yeah, I don't consider those com. I mean, they have funny. They stuff. have funny parts in them, but they're not. They're they're dramedies. Yeah, yeah. And so this was more that. This yeah. was more dramedy. Yes, um, agreed. And so maybe my expectations considering the first one because the first one was very funny and it had a whole bunch of humor maybe my expectations were um t but yeah I, I feel also you kind of have to keep the same comedy for if you're doing a sequel yeah and it's also very interesting that they decided not to continue that anything from the first anything one anything at all outside of their relationship yeah he's circuit and his relationship and meeting at the water with their pant legs rolled up being goons yeah but other than that, and him wearing primary colors as his yes, shirt. Yes, yes, yes. But all of the other aspects, That's yeah, it was what, very interesting. You said what, those old school movies like Pink, not Pink Panther, you said, where they add the same characters. Just oh, not the old schools. Flanagan does that with, for, for, it's not the same characters, but if you watch The Haunting of Hill House, and then you watch The Haunting of Blind Manor, uh -huh. and then you watch um, his newest one, uh, I forgot what it's called, um, I can see the poster for it, but I forgot what it's called. He uses the same cast, just in different roles. Really? Yeah, he loves using the same actors. So you're seeing, it's very jarring at first when you watch Haunting of Hill House, because you're seeing all of these characters that you just spent, I mean, Haunting of Bly Manor. In, in Haunting of Hill House, you've got this series yeah. that you've watched with all of these people playing these characters. And now a new series comes out, the very next one, and it's the same cast playing completely different characters in completely different places in the world. And so you have to take a second and go, okay, he just wants to work with the same cast members because you remember them all as being the family members that were doing this and now they're pretending they don't know each other. It's a weird disconnect. Yeah. But after a couple of episodes, and that's how I felt with this. Yeah. After a few minutes, I went, oh, that's what they're doing. Okay, it almost, I will now adjust. It almost even could have been a prequel. You don't know where this falls in no. line in terms of... Yeah. Because obviously he was in love with the other girl in the other film. Yeah. And we thought they would have ended up together. A lot like and, a lot like 007 films. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Just they could fall at any place, really. <laughs> These are basically two different... Uh, two stories of Muna and Circuit any time in their life. Yeah. Just we don't know. Just we don't know. We don't know when it is. They're just like, and they're standalones. It's basically... You don't need to watch yeah, the first one. Not at all. It's basically, what would happen if Moonabai and Circuit fill in the blank? Yeah. There you go. Uh, you could do another one. What would happen if Moonabai and Circuit fill in the blank? Yeah. Um, and it's it's interesting that, because I, I think I was saying before I said uh, similar to PK and 3 Idiots. Those, I think, have more memorable songs than both of these films. Agreed. Even though, except, even though I love Umuna by MBBS, that's probably the most, and these were kind of jazzy almost. Uh, and they, they, they were nice. Yeah. But I think they had least, less memorable songs the, than the, his others, like three. I agree. And PK. I agree. And the other thing that those have, that the first Umuna by has, mm. is a, a stronger moral to the story this yeah. has a moral to yeah. the story but it's not as strong yeah as as the other one yeah um i agree i i still enjoyed uh son uh sanjay Dutt i did the character too. i uh, sorry, uh, Arsh arshad warzi arshad warzi yeah uh, i really enjoy his character i would if they should make did you like bowman <laughs> he was is he growing on you uh. <laughs> <laughs> it fits in the world it does i like i said i need to watch three idiots again to because that once again first thing i didn't know i know thing. obviously I we know. didn't know a thing and so i'd probably give him a lot more grace 
Is he in Donkey? Let's I see. Hope so. I hope so. Because he was in PK. Yep. Yes. <laughs> Heck yeah, he is. <laughs> that's, that's awesome. That's exciting. That's very uh, exciting. It, was he in um, Sanju as well? Because that's the only other film of... I don't remember. Uh, Rajkumar Harani's uh, filmography that we haven't seen yet. Yeah. I don't... I, I don't remember if he's in that or not. Um... Sorry, I'm trying to look it up here. That's that's fun though. Uh, uh, it's going to be so interesting not to get off on on Donkey because obviously we'll talk about that when that comes out. This is about this film. If that style can still work, yeah, this silly and you don't know if he's going to continue to do that style because that was very of right, the time for right. Hollywood. Everything silly, over the top, but and then still had the heart. But does that work in 2023? It's going to be interesting. But, uh, I'm it, expecting, for the amount of time it's been, and this is an original, not a sequel, this is a first installment, and maybe an only installment, I'm anticipating it to have a really good moral to the story that you're going to walk away with having a sense of, oh, yeah, that's the way things should be made right in the world. Yeah. Which is one of my favorite things about him. It's one of my favorite things about PK is the these are universal truths we need to hang on to to remember that if we apply them, we can make the world a better place. Uh, it's, that's what I love about his films. Bowman is in Sanju. Oh, he is. He that's is, good. That doesn't surprise me. He is his muse. He's his muse, yeah. That is funny. Works with them all the time. <laughs> Basically, it's, it's I've got a film I'm working on. Oh, okay, what are the dates for shooting? It's like Quentin with uh, Samuel Jackson. Yeah, exactly. You're just, just, exactly. You're going to be in my film. You're going to be in my Every film I do, so when are we, do you get a call? Yeah, when are we filming? Um, and so, like, I I am kind of sad that I didn't enjoy it as much as I think other people Me probably too. enjoyed it. And yeah. I enjoyed the first, even though, like I said, I don't hate this film. No. I think this is a, a good, fun film. I it's like just, this one. I loved that one. Yeah, I, I really enjoyed Maybe my expectations were crazy high just because of how much we enjoyed the first yeah. one. Yeah, but I did and like this. It it just, if that's 100, this would be more of an 80. Yeah, I agree. Um. It's just in terms this was of a, how I connected to the film. Absolutely. I, I didn't... Di there's nothing about this I disliked. There were a couple of spots where it dragged a dragged, little bit for yeah, me. Because there, there wasn't enough comedy. No, but but ultimately, I would... Like I said, if this if I happened to turn on the TV and it was on, I would probably keep it on and just enjoy it for a little bit. But, but also, I wouldn't purposefully go well, about I watching it again. if you turned it on with your wife, she would be laughing uh, more than you would. Absolutely. And she'd be of, able to point a bunch of things out that I'd... Be would make me like it more. Yeah, because of obviously whatever the comedy is. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, we've been told that already. Um, he does have a very interesting filmography. It's, I mean, a lot of people have said um, he's never had a flop hit, yeah. and so the only one remaining outside of when Donkey comes out. Uh, oh, also is September seventh. For I did see that okay, on SRK's. Jawan. I saw it on his Instagram. Uh, September seventh yeah. is now the official date. Um, oh, and speaking of SRK. Um, it's, we're getting close to the Knight Riders playing some games here. Oh, are we? We are. The season was announced. They're going to start playing some games. The schedule hasn't been announced, but games will start being played in July. And the arena for them will be up sometime in 2024, maybe 2025. But the first season and the first games are going to be in July. And they're going to be yeah. in Anaheim here. Where? What? I don't know where, what field they're going to use yet. Really? Yeah. That's okay. Yep, because I follow the, I follow the Knight Rider Instagram page. You're gonna be in town. Yep, he'll be uh, here for the opening for sure. Well, he has a house here, so exactly. <laughs> That's but all, anyway, anyways, uh, so yeah, I enjoyed it. Uh, please let us know like uh, the certain comedy that there was. Explain to us like what we missed yeah. and why what certain things were funny. And, yep, because I'm sure there's a ton of that. Um, and uh, I guess the. I'm. We'll get to Sanju before Donkey. Before Donkey, yeah. Because I just want to get to his entire filmography so we can kind of encapsulate it all. And yeah. this would be his most recent. So we'll be able to see his more recent style. Even yeah, A lot right. of people said this one does have heart. It does, It's not like these, though. Well, it's of... probably just the style of the time is changed. And I, I agree. I think Sanju is going to give us more of an idea of where his his style will be for mm -hmm. Donkey. Yeah. Yeah, because that's only, what, five years ago. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that was a, a very. It's about Sanjay Dutt's life, right? Um, which is so interesting. Very interesting, that he isn't it? Is the one that yeah is uh, directing that. 
Um, anyways, let us know what you thought about this film. What should be our next watch along? What should be our next um, Ashran Ashran Ash Circuit? Next yes, Circuit film and circuit film. Sanjay Dutt film that we should watch. Oh, no, we didn't say anything about video. I thought she did well. I just, let me know if it was her voice as well, because I, I am wondering that. <laughs> yeah, she did. She did fine. There yeah, wasn't a lot for her to do with it other than what she did. These, she was she these, was good. These films, like I said in the first one, it's hard to review because it's more about how you felt. Right. More than the artistic part of it. Right. Because this is more about the he was making these films to make you feel good. Right. And uh, well, the I first have, one does it for sure. Yeah. So anyways, let us know what you thought about it down below. <laughs>